New at six from alleged victim to suspect now. Jesse Smollett has been arrested and charged with filing a false police report in what police claim was a staged attack. The incident initially being called a hate crime because Smollett is an openly gay black man. The widespread media attention capturing the country's attention. Our Bill Baraja spoke with Pride Center San Antonio about the impact these false allegations may have and the fear that this may discourage future victims from coming forward. Turn on the TV or log on to social media, and this is what you'll see making the rounds. It's Jesse Smollett's mugshot. The fallout for Smollett comes with a disorderly conduct charge for filing a false police report. But Pride Center San Antonio fears it could be much worse for the LGBTQ community. It affects it in many different ways from people who are true victims of hate crimes. Sometimes they largely go unreported or underreported. Robert Salcido, the executive director for Pride Center San Antonio says, Smollett's alleged actions and false claims have a wide range of consequences. One of them being that people don't believe them. And it's unfortunate that one incident that occurs, uh, such as this one, that people are gonna use it as a reason to say, that didn't happen because we saw it, ha that it was misreported. Smollett allegedly made the accusations because he was unhappy with his salary. The details of the attack include being assaulted, a rope around his neck, and one of the attackers saying this is MAGA country. Salcido says when he first heard the news, he had no reason to doubt it. The Southern Poverty Law Center just shows that recently that within the last four years, there's been a 30% increase in hate groups across the U.S. So we know that the hate is out there. If you or anyone you know has been a victim of a hate crime, Salcido says you should call SAPD. You can also call the Pride Center and they will guide you through the process. Be authentic and tell us what happened to you. And there are people in the community that support you and believe you. Bill Barajas, KSAT 12 News.